terrible day to film. A little new squidgy bio rubber. Just put it on a one eighth jig head and on a number two. The audio is going to be terrible. Sorry, guys. Just doing a bit of field testing. run the camera when I get these hookups because uh, if I do get any hookups this is wind is just making it hard for the audio all right we got our first, first hookup on the new squidgy bios I did that little introduction just oh too light Jerry just 20 yards there I've had about four casts since I got down here the reason why I come down this end was because the subtly's blown right across. And uh, there's my first brim for the session. Nice little one. That's a very nice brim. I come down here to run the new little bio squidgies. I, I took them down the river, down the local river the other day. First drop, I got a beautiful estuary perch with them. So, oh, hey. Sorry, mate. Come on. Let's let this guy go. I'll let him go and then I'll show you how I've been rigging them. They're virtually weedless. See you, buddy. Okay. What I'm doing with the, the rubber is threading it through onto there and come back into its head. That little gap there, so the point of the hook just sits above it. I can put it in there too, but in this sort of thing, I've just got it above it like that. So I can get another one. That was a good bite, good strike, good fish. Fun. Just the ammo twitch. Using any catch down at the moment, so when I get in the odd bite, if I miss one, it doesn't seem to come back. So I'm change that with a little bit of sand. Also, I don't, just don't think I'm getting the distance out to, to get to them. Get off these rocks. Oh, it have to be a big flat the way it's shaking its head. It hasn't even woken up yet. What's that drag that funny? Oh no, no, he's a big old flathead. Oh well, now I've got myself in a very brief trial period, an estuary perch, a brim, and a flathead with the new squidgy bios. That's a really good result. That means that else has a little bread and butter lure made out of that super plastic, so you'll get fantastic value for money with it and can run it on a simple weedless jig head type setup. Come on, buddy. Nice flat head. Yeah, well. I think this is the best part of the having the tackle shop job is doing the field testing. And I tell you, a lot of lures that I do test end up duds. They're the ones you don't hear me talk about. But when I do find these ones with an X factor like this, um, you'll really hear me talk them up. See, I've got him. His lip hooks are the so the lines out of his mouth. So only poor fishing can make me lose this fish. Oh, 
way right now. Okay. Why is it go flooding? Absolutely bugged, so she ain't gonna thrash about or anything. There's a little. That'll just be nice. Magic little setup. See, I'm not in it, I'm through it, out of it, and then in it. Nice. Feel a bit weird talking to this camera while these people are walking around. Probably gonna get another fish.